Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to make a coding bat account so that you can practice your Python problems or your Java problems. So in your browser go to a new tab, type in codingbat.com, codingbat.com. Don't worry about what you see on the screen right here. Over here on the right hand side go ahead and click on create account. For your email address, use your school email address. So remember that's your student ID number at cms. Kate dot I'm sorry at student. cms. K twelve. Nc. Us. For the password, go ahead and create whatever password you want to create. Make sure it's something that you will remember and something that you can um, retrieve if you need to. Then click the Create Account button. Now you'll get a confirmation up here in the upper left. It says Account Created. Before you start, there's a couple things we need to change. So go to Preferences. <laughs> this is where you would also come if you wanted to change your password at any time. But right here where it says teacher share, type in my email address, donaldb.mace at cms.k12.nc.us. Click the share button. Then where it says memo, we're going to type in our uh, last name comma first name and then a dash and then whatever period you're in so if you're in 2a type in a 2a if you're in 2b type in a 2b etc if you have me for both AP computer science and Python programming then type in both courses with whichever one comes first numerically so if you were in 2a and 3a 2a comma 3a and then click update memo And then you can go back to the coding bat home. So if you're doing Java, you work on this. If you're doing Python, you'll work on this page. And of course, if you're doing both, you'll work on both. All right. And when you're finished, you just log out. And that's how you create your own account in coding bat. Thank you.